And guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for Philadelphia. And it's been about their defense. They're playing with a frenetic pace, putting a lot of pressure on the ball handlers and forcing turnovers. Another big aspect of their game tonight has been the fast break, transition opportunity. They're really keeping it up tempo so far. So it's both teams making substitutions here. Philadelphia will go for a different look here. Embiid, he's checked in for Okafor. Richmond comes in for Quincy Pondexter. Wright, he's checked in for Wesley Matthews. And Irving subbed in for Kendall Marshall. Here's Irving. It's deflected. This touch has disappeared on him this quarter. He just hasn't been able to get it going. To the paint. Nine feet out. And Philadelphia grabs the miss. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. From beyond the arc, the offensive rebound. And it's denied. And so it looks like the 76ers will retain possession here. Merlin's Noel checks in for the 76ers. Geiger comes in for Richmond. The Celtics also with a sub. Smart's checked in. The pass to Wright. Wright sets a screen. Back to Irving from the arc. Good. Irving's got five points now this quarter. Six seconds left in the first half of basketball. The three from Thomas. And through the first half, a pretty lopsided affair. 76ers on top, opening up a huge gap. Live from Philadelphia, you're watching 2K Sports. All right, guys, great first half. Home fans are loving it. Still want to go over a couple of things, though. You guys came to play today. What a job shutting them down with our D and running our own offense with precision. I love the focus I'm seeing. I'll say this for us, though. Our shot selection has been terrific. Ladies and gentlemen, your And welcome back to the second half of our Halloween broadcast. Talk about complete control. Everything working in this one for Irving. He has 23 points and four steals. And guys, really impossible to say where he's been better, offensively or defensively. I agree with you, Greg. I mean, he's not missed a beat at either end. That's obvious. Second half underway. Here's who Brad Stevens got on the floor. Thomas is the point with Bradley to his side. Kelly Olenek is out there with Payne. There's the screen. Thomas kicks to Payne. Here's Sherman. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. He's got seven. I'm not sure that was the play they had set up, but it was too good a look to pass up. Irving drives in, misses from close range. Well defended, though, and, and he's not someone who handles that kind of pressure very well. Olenek can't hit. The 76ers leading by 20. Taken away. Sherman covered by Okafor. Outside Thomas. Here's Sherman. That's good. And it's Thomas picking up the assist. Guys, he shot a very good percentage today, and they've needed it. Okay, Let's give a hand to your own Sixers dancers. And now let's take a look at the stats for Thomas. Last season, he played outstanding. 11th in scoring. 11th in steal. saved this team's bacon in several games last year. And oh yeah, one of the most dependable scores in the league, too. Irving against Thomas. Picked by Okafor. Some nice ball movement here by the 76ers. Irving passes to Pondexter. And he gets the shot to fall after coming off the pick. Pondexter's got his second basket of the night. A lot of space right there to get that shot off. Not a very good job of the defender getting over the top of that screen in that particular play. Celtics trail by 20. Thomas kicks to Olenek. 
There's the dish to Thomas. Another shot, and it's good on the way up. Do you, how about the purpose with which he's crashing the backboards right now? Some hard-earned second-chance points. Irving for three. And Boston with the rebound. They'll be playing host to Portland for their next game. That'll be the first of two straight at home. High arcing shot. He misses it. He's four for seven from the floor. Shoots a three. Again, Irving missing. He's not exactly striking them from deep. He had one three ball in the first half. Still bagels in the second. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. Pick by Okafor. Clock at six. Here's Meekins. Another miss by Philadelphia. Celtics trail by 18. Thomas goes in. Olenek. That's in there. Thomas with the assist. Thomas got three assists now in this one. And that's another assist for a team that is putting on a clinic on how to share the ball. And I love the mentality that they've had. If a shot isn't there, they're not forcing it. They're moving it side to side until they finally get the one they want. And that one's good. Thomas got four points now in the quarter. Man, this guy is a scoring machine. I mean, I know I'm not the only one to describe him that way. Picked by Okafor. Irving misses. Good little two-man action there, but they just can't get the shot to fall. Yeah, but that was a beauty. Good-looking shot, well-executed play. I wouldn't be surprised to see them go back to it. It's Matthews on the wing. Back to Irving. Out to the right wing. Three-pointer, Pondexter. It's hauled in by Thomas. On offense, here are the Celtics. They're on a 13-4 run. And a foul called on three. That's his first foul. Marshall, he's checked in for Quincy Pondexter. And the Celtics making a change here. 144 left to play in the third. Thomas up top. He's got eight. To the paint. Here's Olenek. That one a little long. The 76ers leading by 14. Nobody near Irving. Nails the wide open jump shot. Irving's got 29 in the game. Irving with the ball. Noel and Embiid patrol the paint together inside. Geiger is out there with Irving, and it's Pondexter in at the three spot. That's the group in the game for the 76ers. Thomas against Irving, and a foul called on Freak. That'll be his second foul of the game. Here's Crowder, feeds to Thomas. A picture-perfect screenplay, and the jumper's good. Thomas got the fourth quarter going with the first basket of the period here for the Celtics. There's a screen by Noel. He took good advantage of that screen. 32 points for Freak. This guy will really make you pay if you leave him enough room outside. Now Crowder lays up the pick. Near the three-point line, it's Thomas. No good off the back of the rim. Irving attacking. And it goes out of bounds. Uh, last touch by Irving. And that's just carelessness there. I mean, you have got to have your head in the game. Avery Bradley, he's checked in for the Celtics. Celtics trail by 15. Thomas kicks to Payne. Second chance shot, and the rejection by Noel. On the wing, Irving. Dishes to Pondexter. So he gets the whistle, contact on the way up, and two shots coming up. That's good from Noel. Kelly Linux checked in for Festus Azili. That one misses. The Celtics have gone one of four since the end of the third quarter. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Sure could, Kev. I mean, too many empty trips. They need some points. And then Irving slams it in. And that's how you make 
a steel count. Turn it into a quick slam at the other end. It was really a case. It looked like Greg Anthony right there, if I, <laughs> if I can say so. It was really a case of a great defensive play triggering some instant mm -hmm. offense. Yeah, I remember G.A. as an irritant, and this guy, much like Greg, creating havoc out there. And that was Kia bringing you the close-up on the big-time play. Shot clock at three. The feed to Thomas. And the rejection by Noel. And the shots just continue to say no in terms of falling. Back to Matthews. There's a screen by Noel. Irving double team. Here's Meekins. Rebound, Boston. Thomas got four rebounds in this game. Looking to end the drought. No good off the front iron. Yeah, good tough D there to get a hand up and force that miss. That's example number one of why he is such a strong defensive player and why he has such a great defensive reputation. This is not a tough case to crack. I mean, if they want to put an end That's to this the run, they'll need to start getting Kelly back Olsen. on defense. You know, you can't fall asleep in Plus transition. Strong. Everybody needs Isaiah to Thomas. hightail it back to stop these fast break chances. Time out for the 76ers. And Philadelphia making a change here. Okafor's checked in. Philadelphia leading by 19 points. Out of bounds, Boston takes possession. And, and really, just a lack of awareness on his part. Just no idea he was right near the line. Here's Sherman. Can't get it to go. So Philadelphia will take it the other way. Earlier, they held a 23-point lead. Irving for three, and he gets it to go. Irving's got 40 points. You can just see the passion and love. 